and welcome back to my channel or hi if you're new here my name is Emma I make videos I post every Sunday at 8 o'clock so if you're not subscribed to my channel you should go down below and do that right now also my Instagram name is linked in the description box below if you want to go check that out and I'm gonna be posting lots of cute fall pictures hopefully coming up in the next couple of months so yeah get excited for that <sighs> I haven't filmed a proper sit-down video like this I feel like in a really long time so bear with me I feel like I'm rusty at talking to a camera. Uh, it's fine. We're just we're just gonna hop right into this video. So I love fall. If you've been on my channel for a while, or if you know me, you know that fall, autumn, this time of the year is my favorite of all the seasons, and there are many different reasons. So I have actually made a bucket list of all the things that I want to get done or do this fall. So I just thought that I would share my list with you and hopefully inspire some of you to do a couple of these things, or if you're just bored over your break or this season and you want something to do then this video is great for you because it will hopefully give you some ideas the first thing i want to do this fall my number one thing i want to do is take lots of cute fall pictures so i want to go to a pumpkin pumpkin what i want to go to a pumpkin patch and take lots of cute pictures with pumpkins hopefully incorporate some orange into my instagram theme which is currently very blue and white and a little bit yellow and all that but I want to get some orange up in there for fall and so I want to go to a pumpkin patch and take pictures there and hopefully take a lot of cute pictures with leaves and just the beautiful colors of fall the second thing I want to do is to make lots of fall desserts fall recipes create my own stuff that's kind of what I did last week with those pumpkin spice macarons I took an old recipe that was for vanilla turned it into pumpkin spice so I want to keep doing things like that because I think that it's a lot of fun so I'm gonna be experimenting with a lot of pumpkin and cinnamon this these couple months. So I also like DIYs and I'm very excited to make some different DIYs with nature things like nature things. Why do I sound so stupid today? Like pine cones and leaves and what else did I make? Pumpkins, obviously. To make a couple different decor things or just make them for fun, give them to friends, maybe make some birthday gifts. I don't know, we'll see what happens. But I think that it's gonna be really fun, especially to use things that I can find around my yard. Now, you can see I'm currently wearing a sweater and it's like a thousand degrees in my bedroom, but it's kind of cold outside, which is exciting because I'm very excited for the cold weather and especially for sweaters. So my next thing is to stock up on my sweater collection. I like to do this during the fall because, well, I really should be doing it off season because everything's cheaper whatever but I'm going to be hopefully getting some new sweaters so that I can stock up for the colder times of the year so I can wear them like normally like this and I can layer them up when it gets to be a little bit colder in November and December. Thrifting is a thing that I enjoy to do and I didn't do this for my Halloween costume this year which I kind of wish that I could have but it's a good idea for other people to go thrifting for your Halloween costume. So I was Belle for a Halloween thing at Disney World that I did and I'm probably going to wear that again for actual Halloween whether I'm going to a party or whatnot, I don't really know what I'm doing yet. Friends, tell me what we're doing. Anyway, but I could have probably found different pieces from say Goodwill or another sort of like um, thrifting store like that, thrifting store, thrift store, and um, put together pieces for an outfit like my Belle costume or really anything else, especially I've seen this one a lot on the internet, is a group of friends dressing up like the characters from Friends, the TV show. I think that's really cute and you can find things like that from thrift stores. I actually did a project like, I guess that was last year, where we um, recreated an episode from Friends in my theater class and so we went out thrifting and found a whole bunch of different outfits that the characters would wear in the show that we filmed and so if you want to do that for your Halloween costume, highly suggest it's very easy to find stuff like characters like that. So thrifting for your Halloween costume, that's something pretty cool that you should do during the fall that I could do, that my friends could do, that anyone could do. I don't know what I'm doing. One of my favorite Halloween movies is Halloween Town. I haven't actually watched it in like three years, which is why it's on my bucket list, because I want to do a Halloween Town marathon, whether that's with my family, by myself, with my friends. I don't really know. I want it to happen this year though, because I just keep missing out every year and then it gets to be past fall. I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot that was a movie. That's one of my favorite movies. I should probably watch that. And then I never do. So it's now on a list. So now I have to do it. Yeah. The next one's kind of personal, but you know, whatever. I want to get accepted into college this fall. I applied actually for my first college yesterday. Not going to say where because I don't want to get my hopes too high and then say it on the internet and then not get accepted. But I applied to my first college. I'm a parent. I'm obviously going to be applying to more colleges, but the fall time is usually when you find out if you got accepted or not. So that is something I want to do this fall is to get accepted into college. Pray for me. 
yeah. I kind of did this the other day too. Uh, I want to watch a horror movie, but like all the way through. I watched a horror movie with my friends the other day at a sleepover, but I also didn't watch the majority of it because it was really freaky, so I kept covering my eyes, which I didn't think I was that much of like a wuss when it came to scary movies, but apparently I am. So one of my goals this holiday season, fall season, is to actually get through a scary movie and watch the whole thing. So I feel, uh, yeah, I need to do that. I haven't ever done that. So another thing that I definitely want to do is to perfect my pumpkin spice latte recipe. Every year since the pumpkin spice came out, which was like, I don't even know, 2008, maybe? I don't know. When was the pumpkin spice latte invented? on the web for when was the pumpkin spice latte invented holy cow it was invented in 2003 i actually read an article about this recently i could have sworn it had an eight in it maybe it's because the three looks like an eight sometimes i don't know 2003 so maybe not since the year it came out but for the past couple years like say four or five years i've actually tried to make my own at home pumpkin spice and i'm this close to making it taste just like how they do at starbucks but i'm not there yet so i'm going to keep trying to perfect that and last but not least, which I didn't do today, and I don't know why it would have been the perfect time to do it, is to bring out the dark lipstick and the goldeny brown eye makeup stuff. Because I love the darker makeup, and I love the fall makeup looks, so, you know, one might be coming your way, maybe. Who knows? Don't know yet. Haven't planned that. But if you want that, you know, comment, like, down below. Anyway, I'm really excited for the fall makeup trends, and the curly hair, and the sweaters, and all just everything fall. Okay, hair in my mouth now, but especially the makeup. So that's another thing that I'm very excited for. If you like this video, then please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel down below if you're not. Also, like I said before, my Instagram name is in the description box below if you want to go check that out for all of my cute fall pictures that are hopefully coming soon. And I think that's everything, so I will see you guys next Sunday at 8 o'clock. Bye. <laughs>